Let me regale you with a tale of the tea that was spilled in May of 2018. Jamie Foxx, a man with a voice like an angel and moves like a god, divulged some of his wild partying escapades with none other than the founder of Bad Boy Records, Diddy. However, it appears that Diddy was less than pleased with Jamie for airing out his dirty laundry and now, in a tragic twist of fate, Jamie is fighting for his life in the hospital, with some people pointing fingers at Diddy himself. According to insiders close to Jamie, he knew about Diddy's controversial sexuality, and that may have something to do with why Jamie is now lying in a hospital bed, but let's not jump to conclusions. Instead, let's take a trip down memory lane and revisit the days when Jamie and Diddy were the kings of the party scene. Jamie even taught Diddy how to party on a budget, and the two were like a dynamic duo, throwing epic bashes that would make your head spin. Jamie spilled all the juicy details about how he convinced Diddy to attend one of his infamous house parties, inviting the coolest people in town, including Missy Elliott, Jay-Z, and Kanye West. And the best part, Jamie proudly served KFC and Coca-Cola to keep things affordable, explaining that the party was a hit for only $208. Fast forward to today, and Jamie finds himself in hot water. He may have learned some things about the music industry that he wasn't supposed to, and now he's facing ongoing misfortune. There are even rumors that he received death threats during filming, and that he's in a feud with the Mafia. But let's focus on what we do know. Jamie was rushed to the hospital for stroke-like symptoms, and the media is keeping a tight lid on any further details. We don't know what caused it, how much damage was done, or anything else. Jamie's sudden illness has sent shockwaves through the entertainment industry, with producers scrambling on the set of his latest movie, Back in Action, starring Cameron Diaz. The situation is dire, and Jamie's loved ones are traveling from far and wide to be by his side. In the crazy world of show business, anything can happen, and Jamie Foxx's life is no exception. According to TMZ sources, Jamie Foxx was absent for the final eight shooting days of a film, leading to speculations on the internet about the film's completion. Fans fear that the film will need to be finished with the help of a stunt double or a clone due to the actor's terrible condition. Meanwhile, the internet is buzzing with rumors that Diddy is the person coming for Jamie Foxx's life for revealing his true sexuality to others. Diddy allegedly came clean about his sexuality in Blood Orange's song called Hope. However, there is a video from 2017 featuring a very drunk Diddy calling another man Daddy that has recently resurfaced. Moreover, during an interview, the Bad Boy Records founder claimed that he never really partied with Fabulous, despite the rapper insisting that they did, causing suspicion among fans. Despite the rumors and speculation surrounding his sexuality, Diddy has not publicly addressed the issue and seems to be unfazed by the speculation. In 2021, a tweet praising Lil Nas X's performance at the BET Awards became the perfect opportunity for internet trolls to once again poke fun at Diddy and his alleged sexuality. Diddy has confirmed that he is currently dating Young Miami, a rapper in 2023. These are serious allegations that require close attention and a just resolution. Regardless of the outcome, it is essential to take all claims of workplace mistreatment seriously and ensure that those responsible are held accountable for their actions. According to the plaintiff, Mr. Holmes was unclothed and commented about his physique, and Addie was asked about her preferences regarding his unclothed body. The former personal chef lodged a complaint against Diddy for several workplace-related issues, including a hostile work environment. This legal action was initiated after the chef was dismissed in May 2016 and accused of stealing Diddy's timepiece. However, the plaintiff stated that she was framed by a colleague after raising concerns about working conditions. In addition, Diddy's former bodyguard, Jun Dial, supports Jamie Foxx's claims. If Foxx's accusations of being singled out are factual, it may indicate a connection to Diddy or his inner circle. That concludes our coverage for today. Thank you for watching, and until next time.